Hello, family and friends. This is Rob the Sapper Gardener, and today we're going to do something uh, really quick, not a short, but a short video. A uh, friend of ours, uh, Backyard Edible Garden in Los Angeles, uh, did a video, and we saw that, and it was something we haven't had before, but something as soon as I saw it, I wanted to try it. And that's a loco moco, which is a, a Hawaiian treat with a a hamburger patty, rice, a few other things, and it's almost like a Salisbury steak, which I love, so I'm going to do that. I'll show you guys a quick thing. I'm not going to put a recipe because it can be done a thousand different ways, but I'm going to try to show you how we did it. So hang tight, and we'll go through some of the steps. So we made up our, our patties. We first do meatballs, and they've got onions, pepper, uh, salt, uh, Worcestershire sauce, and we're going to fry those up. We're going to do a uh, caramelized onion to go on it. We're also going to do a mushroom gravy, and you can see our mushrooms back there. But once we fry our burgers, then we'll make up our gravy uh, to do that, and then uh, we'll bring you guys back. We're also going to serve rice with ours and a macaroni salad, which is pretty t traditional, and we're going to top our burger patties with an egg. So hang tight, and we'll show you the a couple of the steps in the finished products. sitting down at the table and uh, this is my first crack at doing the loco moco and I like it. It is a little bit of work doing the different things. We've got a uh, macaroni salad on the side. We've got a, a hot coleslaw on the side. We've got some uh, cream corn which we'll show in a different video. And then we've got our rice, hamburger patty, egg, gravy, and uh, I like it. I've never had it in Hawaii, but the next time we go, this will be the first thing I treat Mrs. SG to. Mm -hmm. And uh, she said that there's something in the Philippines that's similar to this. What is it called, sweetie? The burger steak meal. The burger steak meal at the infamous <laughs> Jollibee restaurant, which we love Jollibee. Yeah, yeah. It's just that here, uh, the Jollibee we go to is three hours away. Mm -hmm. And then there's another three hour wait to get us. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so we're going to chow down on ours. I guess I can give everybody a mukbang moment. The gravy is uh, homemade and very easy. If you guys want to see me do a homemade brown mushroom gravy, let me know and I'll be happy to do a quick video on that. Maybe a shorts. All right, we had a battery uh, go dead. <laughs> But we're back and we're almost finished with our meal. Uh, this is really good. We gave credit to our friends at uh, Backyard Edible Garden in Los Angeles. She gave us the idea to try this. Uh, also, I emailed one of our friends, our Secret Santa or Secret Easter Bunny in uh, Hawaii. She gave us some pointers on it too. It's a very simple meal. And uh, just something to change up your routine. Uh, I think most Americans have tried a Salisbury steak and this is similar to it. Uh, we didn't uh, uh, put our ground beef back in the gravy, but you can do that. That's another way to do it. And uh, it'll still be good. So the family enjoyed it. Uh, we're going to go ahead and sign out, finish. 
those of us who aren't finished <laughs> and uh, enjoy time together as a family. So, on behalf of the family at Essiance Family Garden, this is Rob the Sapper Gardener along with Mrs. SG, SK1, SK2, and Sapper Putt Maggie saying God bless our great country America, you wherever you reside around the world, your garden, your harvest, your kitchen, your meals, and especially your family to have health, success, and prosperity as we do. Take care. Snap her out and... SK2 out. Take care, everyone. <laughs>